بله هم ما خیلی ناراحت بودیم از اینکه ما خیلی سعی و تلاش کرده بودیم شش ماه زحمت کشیده بودیم برای که بتونیم در این مسابقات شرکت کنیم و افغانستان رتبه بیاره و زمانی که ویزه ما رد شد خیلی ناراحت بودیم و I got a tweet from someone and then they sent a link about political uh, magazine and then I, I went there and I saw that President Trump approved the girls that they get their visa. I said, oh my God, I can't believe it. And they had to in the same day, they get family permission, they get the, uh, the school's permission, take their clothes, come to the Cobble, go to the embassy, get their visa and get ready for the come to the US. At the beginning, they were, when they went to meet other teams and they saw the robot that they built, they were quite Norway's because they feel that, oh, well, we didn't have experience to work with our robot and we didn't have enough time to design our robot. But they didn't give up and they redesigned again and bring uh, some changes in the robot. Uh, these girls are very uh, sweet and they are very optimistic and they are very uh, hardworking girls and they're trying to be next leaders in the science and technology in Afghanistan. It's not that these kids are building these robots that matters. These robots are building these kids. This robot exercise gives these kids the opportunity to build their self-confidence, to build their understanding of the world of technology. دختران افغانستان در اینجا حضور داریم و نشون میدیم دختران افغان در عرصه های مختلف میتونن دستاوردی داشته باشیم ای که تیم ما تیم دختران افغان هم ما ما این در راینده چیزهایی بسازیم که بتونه وضعیت فعلی افغانستان تغییر بده